All right, class, if you didn't choose to do the animal adaptation worksheet, your assignment for today is page 87. It says, read each sentence below, then answer each question about the words in bold. Let's start with our name, okay? Prefixes. As you reread animal adaptations, you may come across a word that you do not know. Look for the p word part, such as a prefix. A prefix is added to the beginning keyword pre, pre, comes before, before beginning of a word and changes the meaning of the word. Here are some common prefixes. Un means not. So if I'm gonna untie my shoes, that means to untie them, means to not tie them. They were tied, so untie them. Re means to do it again. If I say reread your Christ light story to find the answers, that means to read it again, do it again. And this means the opposite of. So if we're taking a look at our assignment here, we would say, Un means not. It is not common. Un means wa unwanted means not wanted. Unusual means not usual. Here, the dis means the opposite of the lack of disadvantage means that you are not advantaged. And the pre here, re, means to do it again. What does reproduce mean? And to do it again. All right, so let's just try a couple. The prefix me, un means not. What does uncommon mean in the following sentence? It is not uncommon to see birds with pretty feathers. Uncommon means not common or not able to. So uncommon would be not common or you're not able to see these birds. And this one says not uncommon, which means you can see these beautiful birds all the time. Yeah, I know, a little strange. Look at number four, let's do one with dis. The prefix dis means the opposite or lack of. What does disadvantage mean in the following sentence? Without waterproof feathers, they would be at a disadvantage. I'm gonna put down, oops, I should have wrote disadvantage first disadvantage, the opposite or lack of, lack of the ability to be waterproof. Okay. All right, so I got one done and four done for you. Two, three, and five are your assignments for tomorrow. Again, you had a choice. You didn't have to do both, one or the other. All right, have a great rest of your day.